When you start losing community in the heart of community, which is people coming together, connecting and taking ownership and pride around their local place, they disconnect as people. When you start disconnecting as people, you become a lot less tolerant. You become a lot less considered in relation to the impact of your behaviour upon another person. It all becomes about self. Before you know it, you're just consumed in what you're needing to get done in that day, in that manner. I had just started at the Department of Correctional Services and we just recently ran an exhibition, so I had a whole lot of artwork, I had a whole lot of photographs. We wondered how we could build on that exhibition. We decided to look at some of the artwork that was most popular with the public and to use that artwork to give it more public exposure and I guess more permanent public exposure through the rail care program. Community is a group who live and help each other. The grass was wild and you go there, you see all sorts of things, bottles, rubbish. So we decided we have to look after it. While we have great expectations on councils to provide roads and lighting and various services to the community, I think this is one way that we can take a little bit of responsibility for our own neck of the woods. Many people say that they come along because they love the camaraderie. Personally, I think it's the morning tea. The concept of investing into landscaping in an industrial environment like a railway line is ever more important because it provides not only that juxtaposition, but it actually is softening. Green space are the lungs to a city. Green space provides reprieve. They turn something that no one notices or thinks that are ugly into a canvas. You know, people in prison do art as a way to psychologically escape the pains and presses and stresses of prison life. In a way, art at a train station might give the person going to work a little brief visual escape from what's coming at them today. It's been a, an amazing vehicle to be able to bring like-minded people together who are keen to want to make a difference. We've changed the care factor of our neighbourhood. People really care. As a traveller on the train, when you look at stations that are looked after, you smile. What really distinguishes neighbourhood from just a place is the relationships that people have not only to the place, but to each other in that place. Volunteering for me is I do something to make my neighbours happy or for me to thank my neighbours.